We need more, Megan. Hey, Best Pally, I'm Allie, and you clicked on the title of this video so you know what's going on here. It's time to start the M train and crash it through the House of Gaga. What? Obviously, I'll be needing this for the Megan Trainer sound. Let's just see if I can get a scale out. <laughs> song I know on here. I mean, I didn't get a saxophone to play the saxophone. I got a saxophone to play Careless Whisper. Okay, now let's listen to the original song before we give it sax appeal. Actually, Gaga has a whole new album out, which I haven't heard yet. Maybe let's just take a short sidetrack. Chromatica 1. One minute. Of course she has an intro. So theatrical and dramatic. Did she get an orchestra? Are those synth strings? If they are, I'm jealous. I need to buy better synth strings. Okay, yeah, but everyone knows the overture is the worst part of the show. Okay, good, thank you. Oh, except this is the song that comes before the two hit singles, which means it's a garbage song that she wants people to like. It's like, oh, I guess I'll get through Alice before I get to the two hit. Not doing it, Gaga, I'm not getting sucked in. This one was early on YouTube, so it feels like it's also a hit. Ooh! I moved. Sounds so familiar. Da, 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 da. That's the thing about pop music. It works if you can find something that's completely new but super familiar. You do the same thing over and over again, but very different. Why? Why do I know this? Why am I playing on this when that's there? This is just my go-to whenever I hear a melody out in the wild and I'm like, hmm. Whatever. Focus on what I'm doing. It'll rain on me. Ooh, stupid love is so good though. Ah, and it didn't take off. I really want rain on me to be a popular song so that people search for it and watch this video. But also, it's really good. Okay, let's watch the video. Oh, opening with soaring Gaga vocals. If Gaga hadn't written this, I'd be like, you're ripping off Gaga. Here, let me show you. I didn't ask for a free ride. There ain't a reason you and me should be alone. So Gaga. But it's not just Gaga in this song. Ariana. Oh, when they trade off. So cool! Oh, goosebumps! What is it raining on me? This really is a bop. The video is, of course, the perfect Gaga fantasy. Do you want to be the hero in your own fantasy world? You can with Rain. Oh, okay, close. Rain Shadow Legend. Uh, again, go away. I mean, not. That's cool that I just got bonuses. And thank you to Raid for making this video possible. I had to switch over to my desktop to show you that it's on mobile and PC. I think this game is cool because of the graphics. It's really impressive looking. Plus, I like making my team of heroes and then I equip them and train them and you can upgrade them. Here, let me show you. I'll go to the portal. I'm gonna open a shard. Summon. Oh, sweet! Drake. Ha <laughs> ha! The rapper! And also dragon, I guess. Well, I'm talking about graphics. This is gorgeous. I mean, he's a very pretty dragon. Hello, sir. Shall we summon another? Chaplin. Hello there. Are you chilly? Sweet hood, no. Snap. Gonna get sunburn out there in the Arctic. This seriously is one of the coolest parts. Alright, summon one more. We got... What? <laughs> Yosemite Sam after too many deadlifts. So this is awesome. It kind of looks like... I had to Google. It's Eddie Hall. <laughs> the world's strongest man. Looks just like this. Anyway, sidetracking in the middle of trying to tell you... Okay, you can go play tournaments with your team against other people in the raid community like... Me, perhaps? My name is Ace Bags. Oh, let's do one. Ooh! I'm in the spider's den in a dragon tournament. Take that, you fiery demon! Victory! And victory means you win artifacts and rewards. And if you're a new player, you'll get 100,000 silver, two clan boss keys, 10 mystery shards, and one free champion. Executioner. That's an awesome champion, especially if you're just starting out. So what are you waiting for? Go! The package that they're offering my pallies is only gonna be there for the next 30 days. And when you sign up and you're a new person, it'll be right up here, all that stuff that I told you was gonna be there. Okay, now back to making things sexy. Let me just Google what the lowest note on alto sax is. It looks like I've already Googled that. I'll probably just put it in my brain. This one. Oh, that sounds so bad. This is fine. I'm doing just like a MIDI placeholder. That means I'm transposing to A, which is great because she's an E and I don't have a Gaga range. She has this repeating line through the whole song. It goes boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. And when there's one thing looping in a song the whole time, it makes me want to do this. Uh. I had this series called One Gal Band, and last time I posted it was 2018. Maybe you're an OG Pally and you know what I'm talking about. Perform all the instruments of the song and loop them so I'm like playing on top of myself and you're watching it unfold in real time and they're very hard to do, and now I should probably do it.
Oh! Should I make this a one gal band music video? No. Yes. Oh, I'm going to, obviously. But uh, <laughs> definitely happening. Hmm. Thank you for going on this journey with me, Pallies. <laughs> I just added a whole lot of work to my schedule. Okay, let's crank through this. <laughs> the piano. That's dumb. Let's try something else. Nope. Double time. I don't. This is not good at all. I know. Tambourine will fix it. I've said this before. Most important instrument. That's what's missing. If Tambourine can't fix this, I don't know what can. It's just not Megan. I neglected to play any of her for you, probably because I need less sidetracks, but here we go. Uh, this is the tempo that I'm using right now, which is the same as Gaga. But what I think we need is to move up to lips are moving tempo. Ooh! Hear the tambourine? Oh, it's so good. Mm. Okay, we're going faster. Mm, after I listen to it a little more. She also used, like, internet people on this. Yeah, what the heck? Where's my call, Megan? I can get you the clout that you need. Put me in your video. Anyway, let's try 140. Mm, let's not. We need more, Megan. <laughs> Dear future husband. Oh, oh, oh. This one's at 160. This is it. This is gonna solve it. I'm just gonna keep it playing so that someone close to Megan Trainer, like her lawyer, has to sue me for putting this in my video. <laughs> it's not even gonna get to her lawyer, it's gonna be a robot that's like, stop it. Ugh. See, there was a reason I held off on playing it until now. Let's just have some more. After every fight, just apologize, and maybe then I'll let you try and wrap my body right. Song, get back to the thing that I'm doing. What am I doing? Can I just change my channel to me playing music I like and hanging out with you on camera and that's it. Except that this music video is gonna be dope if I can pull off the vision that I have, so let's do it. That's still not it. That's what I wanted to do. I think the chord progression needs to be more Megan Trainer. Right now we're just a Megan Trainer bra and we need to be a Megan workout trainer. Uh, what I mean is it needs to be simpler and more com Complete sounding, like, resolve -y. Gaga never brings you back to comfortable, like, here's where the one is. I'll show you, let me adjust. Yes! Now I painstakingly figured out harmonies, which I'm not gonna show you because I'm not fast at it! I have it here just as a synth line. This is gonna be four of me. Cool. Rain on me, rain, rain, rain on me. Shoe up. Yes, yes. Did I Madden do up? Now this is just MIDI programming so I can figure out the arrangement and then use the real stuff. Because it will sound way better when it's that guy, not to this guy. <laughs> it's like an orchestra fart. Now I gotta turn this into a whole song. And I always think about this whenever I'm doing an arrangement. It's a great example of exponential growth. The first copy is nothing. And the second copy is still kind of small. And then once you start doubling and doubling and doubling, look at this. Ah, it's getting out of hand very quickly. Look how many just by doubling every time. In case you needed a math lesson in the middle of this, ah, uh, <laughs> I am very good at sidetrack. Oh my god, I think it's Britney. No, maybe. Come here, iTunes. Because obviously I have iTunes music because I'm on my brother and sister-in-law's family plan, not because I pay for it. Which also means when you order a dating app at 1 a.m., your brother gets pinged about it. And I mean, as that's a general example, not speaking out of any sort of thing that happened to me. Wow, I am sidetracked in the middle of my sidetrack. Okay, it's gotta be, it's maybe. <laughs> Is dripping all over my face. 
I'm sour candy. I'm not crazy. I may be a little crazy. Did any of that make sense as I was figuring it out? Whatever. That's awesome. Oh, I feel so satisfied. Huh. Okay, Gaga, similar melody to this. Great. Okay, back to unsigned trekking my Now this represents all the instruments I'm gonna play for you on camera, and they have to unfold. I have to make them happen. They can't all go at once. So what I think would be cool would be to start with the bass and kick and hi-hat. I could pull all three of those off at the same time and then bring in the claps and the kabasa, which I always want to call cassaba for some reason. Is cassaba a thing? It is. It's a melon. Anybody else have this problem between kabasa and cassaba? Sidetracked! So after I have all that going, then the saxophone happens and then the piano and then all of my harmonies, but I have to sing them one at a time and layer on top of myself. I'll get everything performed and then cut it out so I can sing the first verse. Here's Ariana's part that I'm going to be singing. Oh yeah, I don't have Gaga to sing with, so my piano is going to be her part as we're trading off. I feel like the verse still needs something like, how do I make this a jumper? I mean, more impressive. I know! Ukulele, the least impressive instrument. Just kidding, if you play the ukulele, I'm not insulting you, it's just very easy to learn. Listen to Amanda Palmer's song about it. But also, I'm not on the real instrument situation yet, so let's just synth it. Enough for now. And I think that's pretty much it, except this other thing where I have to rap. Megan Trainor raps in a lot of her songs on the verse in Lips Are Moving. Tell me that you're not just about this bass. She's about this bass. Funny story, this gal. <laughs> what is her name? Casey? Uh, getting sidetracked. Okay, hold on. Megan Trainor, Megan Dancer. Yeah, her. Oh, Kelsey. This sidetrack is worth it. I was at a club, it was like 1 a.m., and I saw this girl. And I recognize her from all of Megan Trainor's music videos. I was like, hey, are you a dancer? Yes, I spoke to her. And she was like, I am. How did you know that? And I was like, you killed it in Dear Future Husband. <laughs> and she was like, what? I mean, thank you. Well, okay. And I was like, does this happen to you all the time and you're recognized? She's like, you are the first person to have ever recognized me. Oh my God. And I was like, huh, well. That's yeah. That's great. I'm a big Megan fan. But I think I followed her on Twitter the next day. She didn't follow me back. That's the end of the story. Oh, super weird. Just attacking strangers in public with my fandom. Anyway, that's it. I think I have the arrangement. I just gotta figure out now how to play the song that I wrote. I mean, not wrote, arranged. Though I did change the melody a little. What chords do I need? These aren't any of them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is that? Okay, piano's the easy part. You know what I really want to do in this is perhaps a mashup. Don't tell me not to live, just sit and putter. Life's candy and the sun's a bowl of butter. Don't bring her on the cloud terrain on my parade. Okay, that doesn't work. Sometimes my mashup dreams are only dreams and should stay that way. <laughs> I only gotta get it right once. Hooray! I'm pretty okay with the individual parts now. The next step was to figure out the setup so I can reach everything in time, and behind the scenes, my drums are crammed over here looking stupid, but that'll be hidden because all I need is that hi-hat and that kick. A funny thing about a lot of these is that I'm trapped in this corner by equipment, so the only way to get in to rehearse or record is by this struggle that you never see. And now is when I have to choreograph it. At this point, I no longer consider it music. It's now dance because I have to put my body in the right position at the right time to execute correctly. <laughs> Film time. I've completed all of my practice because I'm perfect now. No, because I ran out of time. I gotta put this video up so I either get it today or I throw out... Excuse me, computer. I'm trying to... Okay. This is now just a race to see if I can get one perfect take start to finish before I sweat through these girls. You know, I think about this a lot. Whenever I was a competitive dancer, my teacher would say, an amateur does things until they get it right, and a professional does things until they never get it wrong. And with all of my one gal band songs, I just do it over and over until I get it right one time perfectly, and then never play the song again. So clearly I'm an amateur. <laughs>
so I don't lose my mind. Baby, I can feel it on my skin. See your drops on my face. Let it wash away my sins. Let it wash away. I'll be your galaxy, I'm about to fly. Rain on me, do a rain on me, do a tsunami. Hands up to the sky. I'll be your galaxy, I'm about to fly. Rain on me, I'd rather be dry, but at least I'm alive. Rain on me, do a rain on me, do a tsunami. I'd rather be dry, but at least I'm alive. Rain on me, do a rain on me, do a. Yeah. Awesome. I had to listen back to make sure, but heck yeah, that was the take. And also realized that there's like a stain on my shirt, kinda, I don't know, that'll be all the comments. Great, but I am not doing another take and changing my shirt, so that's it, we're done. And also, I can't believe that was the take because my saxophone fell off my strap in the middle, but I kept going, heck. And if you'd like to see more Outrageous, there are a lot more videos down there.